I have got my social club account open on a different computer so I can see what I'm up to, what I've still got to go and all that. Turns out for the Strangers and Freaks missions, there's one for Franklin. That I'll do first. Hey, I'm going, man, before you take advantage. Which is to give Tonya a call. Supposedly, he got a text message from Tonya ages, like, near the start of the game to give her a call. Which I never took noto notice of, and I never called. So that's emails this one and I don't have it there somehow it must have deleted itself so I'm gonna give her a call my brother from another crack mother what's going on now JB niggas gone a wall baby I don't know what to do is he ever not a wall? He's bad, Franklin. Got his claws in deep this time. They're on to him, leaving messages, saying he gonna get cut. You ain't gonna let a sister starve. Look, man, I'm not gonna let that happen, all right? Now leave it with me. Okay. Not my car, but I'm gonna take it. And of course, music. Oh, I can't get out that way. Look inside yourself. Step outside yourself. This is the way I get out. Then cut a hole in yourself. Then look inside yourself with yourself. Look inside of the person you step up. Break down the rules of society and watch what happens. A bunch of sleep deprived maniacs forming tribes, raiding other parties, taking hostages, fashioning weapons out of air. Oops. They got in my way. Let's take a call. Hi, Jake. You're on chakra attack. I want to talk about people with birds. Why do people have parrots? Animals shouldn't talk. And ones that do should be shot. Oh, good. Oh, I don't know. I love it when dolphins talk. No harm done. Hopefully I can remember how to use the tow truck. Same thing. Don't you correct me on the air in front of my people. Next call, who are you on the line? I am calling from the San Andreas State Penitentiary. Ah, uh, this call. I remember this part of the radio. We probably all do by now. Just enjoying, enjoying doing some donuts. As long as I can get there in time. Got to get there before the train.
Get new. Yes. That was my target. That was my aim to push you clear. You had time to call the tow company to aim. Then the engine just cut out. Damn car, foreign trash. I've told my wife a hundred times. But she's like, oh no, Phil, you can't say that. Not anymore. She'll soon change her tune when she finds out I nearly died. All this fancy You nearly died because you refused to get out the car. Sign that treaty, a mile less of the gallon, and maybe I wouldn't have ended up on top of the train tracks. I'm at a loss for words. Me. Oops. Makes a nice change though, to get towed for a good reason. Normally I'd be cussing you out, you know, asking you how you sleep at night. I'm sure you would, man. You been in the business long? Uh, I ain't exactly in the business. Just helping out a friend, dog. Yep. Just helping out a friend that can't be bothered doing his own job. That can't be bothered working. Oops. Hey, wait, it came unhooked. It did. There we go. I also teach paid art marketing, so the game mafia will think you're one of them. I am Lorenzo O'Hulahan, dream maker. Contact me today. Telling you what to think about it, what to think about everything. For 35 years, it is WCTR. Hopefully that's close enough. Okay, thanks again. That could have been much worse. Well, it could have been worse, as in the car could have got destroyed. You can tell JB I did his work for him again. I will, boo. Soon as he wakes up. So that one was called pulling favors again. Okay, if I got there without it unhooking, I would have got that bonus. Oh well. All good. So now, I need to wait for another text message from her for the next one there. I do have another one I can do straight away as Michael. I did already do this one as Franklin. I thought it didn't matter who you done it with, or I thought you had to do it with Franklin, but you need to do it as Michael, which is the Epsilon program. So, why has he got water splash spraying off his hand? <laughs> I'm going to go to the website for the Epsilon program. There is no link for it here that I can see, so type it in here. Go to this site, click evaluate, evaluate your identity, that one, 
and complete the evalu evaluation form. Do you have red hair? No. Do you ever experience deja vu again? What do you mean again? Sure. Do you want to understand completely to be complete? What? That doesn't really make sense. Sure. Do you have the endurance to lie with nine partners a week? Wow. No. Do you consider attractiveness related relative to your own attractiveness? What? Uh Yeah, uncertain. Do you have a birthmark on your face? No. Do you want to be famous? No. Are you able to look at things and see them as, as metaphors for other things, like trees and eagles? Uh, I guess so, sometimes. Say yes. Can you easily ignore your entire family and join a new group of friends? Yep. <laughs> that was an easy one for me. Unfortunately. Do your cheeks clear? Do your checks clear? Well, I've never written a check, but I've also never been in debt. So yes. Get results. You have an enlightenment level of 24%, which is in the highly undesirable band. Your graph reveals you are extremely unfulfilled, depressed, unsuccessful, and lacking in pro purpose, and sometimes feel like stabbing out your own eyes, or the eyes of others. Wow. I don't feel that at all. Please realize that this is not our opinion of you. It's your opinion of your run through a very complicated ana analysis machine that we sell for a profit at the Epsilon gift shop. The, the important question is, do you appre appreciate the limitations of your misunderstandings? It is vital that you disconnect from your inadequacies. You must take action. Travel through the dawn to the past pictured in your in our brochures. Look for a red truck with a dent on the right fender. Raise your left hand and recite the words, Take me to my father, father, brother, uncle, Kiflon. We'll do the rest. Because we all know, there is Kiflon and there is Krant. And both be praised. I did get an email while reading that. So, what was this email? No, maybe it was a text. No. That was for the last mission. I don't need those, I'll clear out those. Uh, um, did I get a email? I reckon I got that email. Damn tablet making noises. Okay, that's from his therapist. That now has a TV show.
Wow, that's some kind of response to your therapist. That one's a bit long, I'm not going to bother reading that, I'll just reply. Okay, I don't think I actually replied to that one. There we go. Yep, there we go. And that one's even longer. So I'm not gonna... Read it. These are just saying guns available. Okay, so there's the way I go to the email, go to the link website in emails. I press spacebar. Just going through these to clear these out. There we go. They're all clear. So... That was the first one of this Strangers and Freaks mission. Of eight different ones in this thread. I'll see what that question mark is. Is that the next part of it? And then tell women out there to stand up, stop complaining, and make something of themselves. I believe in hard work. You had a very public divorce, Miss Murray. Yes, that was unfortunate. But I stood up for what I deserved in divorce court. Our Hopefully it doesn't take too long to get to it. Looks like it's a bit out of the way in quite far away. What she's just said then is pretty much every politician I know of. They'll lie and change their mind just to get what they want. Well, not that they change their mind. They just lie about what they're saying. And is why I don't... I never trust politicians. Well, there's another two me emails. And of course, knew that would happen. Not sure where that sound was. I thought it. Oh, that was Steam. If it happens again, I'll tab out and I'll mute, mute or I'll disconnect from Steam's friend connections I'm sure I know what it was I have a couple of Steam friends that insist on always inviting me to play a game with them that I don't own they know I don't own it but they always invite me to it. 
and often they'll invite me four or five times in a row. I don't think I should be going in there. Probably shouldn't be on this road either. Come on, car, you can do it. How'd my front window get broken? Oh, it might have been when I hit that wall. I completely forgot I hit it. This is a terrible side to be on, so many bumps. Oh. Why do I even turn, spin around that way? I'm almost far enough around that I don't need to go up, but it'll be easier to go up and over than go around more. Now that I can go up, On this road, there's the vehicle I need. Ah, red truck, huh? Yep, a red truck. Peace, brother, brother. Kiflum. Oh, Kiflum. Ow! Oh. What was that for? I came willingly and you attacked me. Strip me? What? Really? Why'd you take my clothes? And you leave me out here with no vehicle? How come? Really? 
How rude. I believe that one was accepting the truth. I do need to turn that radio off. No. Accepting the truth is the next one. So that was still a part of the first one by the looks. So let's check out these emails. Dr. Friedlander. This one is an, an even longer one. I know. So that's the first one. That was my reply. So this one's not that long actually. I can't reply to that, so that's the end of that line. This one's only short. Okay, and from Marnie, from the Epsilon program, give us $500. Please visit our website at epsilonprogram.com and donate $500. Okay. Okay, there you go. Thank you for your donation, brother, brother. Kiflam. Be praised. Kiflam. Now I guess I just drive around and wait for something, do I? I'll wait for a message to come through or something. Was that car needing something? I know nothing showed on the map. No, I guess not. While I'm waiting for that, I'll go back and... continue some... Random events. Where am I? I am...